Hi guys, Leticia here. Welcome back to my video. Today I'm gonna talk about. Uh, actually, when I I have another video talk about how I became a K-pop fan, and I wanted to make a video how I became uh, like an army part of such a big fan that we know today. And I'm very very happy. Like every other army around the world, about how successful BTS became. You can't even imagine how, how I'm so happy for them. Like I'm really, really happy. So I wanted to make this this video how I became an army. Like even before I was part of the army, I knew about K-pop and I was listening to Girl Generation and other K-pop group. If you watch my video how I became a K-pop uh, fan, you will understand that. You will know that. Uh, actually became an army now in 2013 like some people but in 2014 so I remember listening at that period where I was listening to K-pop because my first language is French I was listening and I was watching a lot of French music video and usually I went to the comment section and I was like <laughs> listening to some people they was talking about bts army once you deem me you never deem out like stuff like that related to bts like they're like army army i was like wondering what is this i'm like every random video i was just taking i was watching i was coming in contact with bts like somehow and also if it, about that period i think it's about that period or maybe in 2013 i remember i wasn't part of the army but i remember when bts debuted in 2013 and i know there was like the uh, i was watching tv because even in america we had uh, and then they was showing like a new comeback new group debut thing and stuff like that i remember when bts debuted in 2013 and yeah, but at that period, I wasn't listening to any new K-pop group, really. I wasn't really, I'm not saying not pay attention. I knew there was BTS. I knew there was a new K-pop group called BTS. I remember listening to Girl Generation and other, like, Wonder Girls. Like, I remember listening to all those groups, like, I don't know if there was sister sister girl generation wonder girl uh form it all those k-pop group i was listening to them just that generation of k-pop and everything and exo actually debuted uh, in 2012 so edit exo also stuff like that yeah i heard about bts and what really drive me into bts was i was watching a tv one day i don't remember if i actually put like usually when at, at home on saturday i like to clean and when i was cleaning i usually put k-pop song you know when you go to youtube and you put all k-pop song like that i don't know if it was during that period that i listened to one fine day by bts or it was during the period i don't remember my brain is so messed up uh, it was during the period I like, am that put one fine day by BTS. Anyway, it was that song. I listened to that song. I was like, wow, this group can sing. I was like, I knew man, I wanted. I love that song. I was like playing that song in repeat every single day. The, I was just focusing on them. Then I was listening to other music, but. I wanted to know more about them. I started listening to Bulletproof to uh there's another music uh um uh the war hormone all those songs of BTS and I went back listening to 2013 song I listened to 2014 song 2015 song was so beautiful we all dope song and, and how do we fire and all those combat and now 2018 i've been a army for since 2014 i was like when i listen to one fine day i'm like i want to know about this group i want to know who they are 
they're saying so well i want to be part of this fandom that people talk about the army and everything i'm like why once you deem me you don't deem out like people say it's true you cannot be part of the army and then say bye i'm not a part i'm not part of the army anymore it's such an interesting fandom if you deem in, you can deem out it's like <sighs> yeah that's it since 2014 now i'm an army i'm very proud and i'm very proud to see, to see how successful bts has become become which is i'm very proud of everything i watch about bts some people will say the army is this the army is that but because they are not part of the army you cannot really judge people you can judge people from the outside but once you get into know us this fandom you will be amazed once you deem me you there is no way for you that you will be able to deem out so since i be part of the army i'm so proud i'm so proud of this fandom i'm so proud or how successful bts has become i'm so proud some people seeing the more successful bts become the more people become part of the army i'm so proud people asking what those people even ladies in america and uh, jimmy fallon show people were so amazed by the performance of of, of i'm fine and uh and the new song oh, i have a brain freeze i have a brain freeze how do we idol okay people was listening to the people who used to judge them that they lip sync they was actually able to hear them breathe and say wow this group is amazing how can they sing and dance at the same time so i'm so proud of all the accomplishments bts had done and i'm very looking forward for what they have to do next i'm pretty sure they have they're gonna have an amazing career and they keep going higher and higher so Thank you for watching this video about how I became part of the army. And if you are not an army yet, what are you doing? What are you waiting for? Are you waiting for BTS to touch the sky for you to be army? Come on. You're wasting your time. And see, it's such an amazing fandom. What are you waiting for? Okay. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video.